Yeah. Whoa. Hello everyone, welcome to my unboxing channel. This is Ru. Um, this is a channel where I unbox everything that comes in a box. Um, but today, um, this is not a box, it's a little, small little package. I've got this in now uh, in Kickstarter and well, we'll just open it and we'll see what it is. Okay, um, so what, what I've got here today to unbox and to show you guys uh, is a pretty um, exciting project that I've seen in Kickstarter. Um, this is what we call the micro wallet, doing more with less. Um, this is created by Elliot Burko. It had 10,525 backers. Um, pledge about 344,000 USD, and um, of course, I'm, I'm one of those of backers. Right now, let's go through um, all the wallets. So, this is the um, this all called the artist design perfect fit. Um, this is actually what we call a paper wallet but um, it's technically not um, paper. It feels and looks like paper, but um, they use what they call a Tyvex uh, material, which is uh, much stronger um, than normal paper. So, um, let's see what it says here. Zoom in. Designed to be the slimmest, smallest, and safest wallet at just 1.3 millimeter thick. It's durable, waterproof, eco-friendly, comes with space for 8 cards and cash, and RFID protection. Both contains 8 cards and cash with the wallet. So I think this is a this is the our, um, artist's interpretation of how thin the wallet might get. So I don't think this has 8 cards in it. Um, so this will be your typical wallet. This is our goal right here. Give it this tin. Okay. So let's let's go through again um, all the wallets I have. This is the graphite design. I'm touching it. It feels just like paper, really. Okay. Now this is the black. This is the leather print. This would be an interesting one. This is an art by Roman Klonek from uh, Dusseldorf, Germany. Okay, okay without further ado, uh, let's open up this package and see what we have inside. Oh, pretty nice. It's no um, glue. Uh, they put in a Velcro in here, which is pretty awesome. It means I could open all four of them and put them back again. So, um, what this wallet has again are uh, uh, FID protection. Your data and identity is safe from thieves. Water resistant. Tyvek material protects against the elements. Durable. Tear resistant Tyvek ultra durable material. Expandable. Designed to expand with, with use to fit your needs. Eco friendly, 100% recycled. Um, so, what it says here is artists design original pieces. We are always looking for new talent and design. Designed at paperwallet.com. So, doing more with less. I like the packaging. So, this is a layout of what the wallet looks like. Um, it has the RFID shield right here. Um, it takes USD, Great Britain, Euro, Yen, and many more um, notes. Four cards slot fits up to eight cards. Okay, it says here it's Tyvek, smart material. So small and comfortable, you will forget it's there. <laughs> Touch me. Oh, there it is. 
it's very um, small and compact comparing to my wallet so this is pretty exciting I'm, uh, I'm very excited to see just how slim I could get with this wallet Exactly like paper. I'm not sure you guys can see this, but it's R D right here. Let's remove the card here. It says thank you. Here's ten percent off your next order. Wow! I got a ten percent off card. Okay. Oh, it looks like there's a leaf in here. Carry with style. Um, okay, uh, what it says here? Paper wallet is influenced by the art of origami and aim to create a unique and functional canvas for artists to get their work off the wall and give it legs. With the environment in mind, Hyper Smart Material was our optimal choice, and its supreme durability increases the overall quality of the product. The end result is well engineered fusion of design, function, and comfort. Wallet.com. So this is where you can go if you guys are interested in this wallet. Quick advertisement here. So this is the wallet. Um, yes, RFID here, but I. They said um, there's two slots here. <laughs> you know, to be honest, it's. It feels really flimsy because like I said it's just like paper and I'm, I'm pretty scared about handling it. It feels like I could just break it. <laughs> I'm not gonna test that out so yeah. Well okay, this is the first one. We'll take to, we'll take a look at the other tree. So this is the um, leather print. like it's pretty much like leather feels like paper so, wallet it's pretty much the same thing here. this is the black Even though it's black, you can see there's some um, texture design on the wallet itself. The same thing again, paper wallet, RFID right there. Two slots here. One slot right here. Oh my god, this feels like I could tear it. So this will be the more interesting design. If you like, um, you know, going out and trying to make a statement. Uh, it's a pretty cool design. Looks like a little snake or a dragon. Let's open that up. Pretty cute manga design here. So this is uh, Roman Kolek, the designer. Uh, I think this is the yes, same thing. Well, let's take it out and look at the design, overall design. This actually looks like a face. You can see the eyes, the nose, and the mouth here. Really nice design. Okay, so here's the wallet. Um, I've put in. No, well, let me show you guys one thing here. Um, there's a, a quick instruction here actually on um, uh, a quick guide actually to tell you um, what it feels like when you first use this wallet. 
Um, as you can see there it says that it starts off tight and expands when used. Two cards per card slot. Fold bills at the edge. See the dagger on the right, so meaning this is a, this is the knot here, so you just fold edge right there. Uh, minimize stuff, increase comfort, which is true. You don't need a bulky wallet. Use with magic coin pouch. That's I'll talk about that in the, in the shop while. So um, here's the wallet itself. Um, I fit. I didn't fit in. Um, total of eight cards. Uh, there's only seven cards in here. Okay, um, with one um, 15 ringgit note, um, which is folded like so. You guys can see the camera. So this is with seven cards. Okay, I'll show you guys. One, two here. It's one. This feels particularly really tight. So I, I, I don't really have. 16 cards actually, and it got 15. Um, so, but it was pretty tight uh, on this edge right here. So, it feels like I could bring some something. So, I didn't want to take the risk. So, but so there's two cuts here and two cuts right there. Okay, and this is how it looks like. So, let's compare it with. I consider it to be the slimmest word that I have. The Balroy. Okay. This is still. Um, I had um, nine cards in here. I took out one to put it on the um, on a micro wallet. Um, so it's three cards here, two cards here, and three cards down there. Okay. So three, three, and two. That's eight. A cash with a note in there and some paper. Okay. Holy shit, this is really slim. Look at that. Look at that. Now we're talking about one of the slimmest wallets in the market right now, Bellroy. But yeah, we are talking about, we're comparing the slimmest wallet in the market with this. awesome this is really slim I like this so thank you Bellroy moving on with micro wallet now <laughs> okay um that's the unboxing for micro wallet now I got one more thing to unbox which is the coin pouch I'm really excited for this as well um, it's very hard for me to find a really nice coin pouch to take around with you because I'm the kind of person who likes to have a very slim wallet. I do not want to have coins in my wallet. Um, the Bellroy has a section here that you could put in coins, but it makes your wallet bulky. You have you can see your coins um, on on the side here, so it's, it doesn't look nice. So um, it has Velcro as well. Uh, it says pretty much the same thing: water resistant, durable, expandable, eco-friendly. Artist designed original piece. Touch me, um, Tyrex. I think that's how you pronounce it. Tyrex. Carry with style. So this is how you use the coin pouch. Put it in a wallet right here. Um, you shift it to the other compartment, and then you fold it back. Um, so you can. There's an opening right here, and there's no opening right there. So you just gotta move the coins to the side, and um, you will permanently be locked in there. Carry with style, handle coins better. <laughs> like that. Okay. So I got the black design. Okay, well, let's just read this first. For best use, practice shifting coins in your coin pouch with only a few coins at first. A new coin pouch starts rigid, but use the material will soften and expand, allowing you to fit more coins. Use your paper wallet slim flat or card wallet. Use with your paper wallet slim flat or the card wallet. Okay. So let's take a look at the back here. It says our coin pouch works, feels, and looks like magic. It helps you handle the most uncomfortable forms of cash with comfort. It's time for change. Paper 
wallet.com. Okay, so this is a coin pouch. Uh, again, it feels just like paper. Um, but I think they purposely crumbled it up to make it look more like um, a, a leather kind of material. There's a stitching right there. It says paper wallet back here. Um, oh, we got some leaf right there. Boom! Thank you. Here's ten percent off your next order. Woohoo! So this is stitching right there from here all the way to this side. So the coins will come down from here, and I guess you shift them on this side. So let's try it out. Okay, so um, got some coins here, and got a. Coin 20, 10, and now 20. So I'll put in the 20 cent coins. Put it there. Put in another one. Cool. So I'm supposed to flick it. Uh, I'm not sure how you look at this. It's still here. <laughs> Okay, so it's right here now, and the coins is locked in place. So you want to take out the coins, flip them again. Okay, need a lot of practice here. So boom. Um, so you can see, um, comparing with the 50, 50 cent coins, um, I think you can store quite a lot of coins here. Whoa. Okay. Should um, should it go down? No, flicking the right way. Okay. The tutorial seems really easy, but um, it's because it's pretty rigid. It's not that easy to flip them over. If you guys are interested, you can go to umpiboiler.com. They got more designs here, I can show you guys. They have um, uh, different designs, uh, so I had the Roman Clonex design, um, got the David Rollar. Okay, so these are the pretty awesome designs that you could choose from. If you're not interested in that design, um, which um, what I've chosen is the um, graphite, jack black and leather design. So thank you guys for watching um, the unboxing for Micro Wallet. I'll put in a link below if you guys are interested in getting this wallet. Again, I got this in Kickstarter. I'm not sure if it's available now on sale. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please give me a thumbs up. Um, comment below, please um, share subscribe that will help me a lot and again thank you for watching and i'll see you guys next time